1969 Buckeyes rolled into Ann Arbor averaging 46 points per game and riding a 22-game winning streak. One of those wins by Woody Hayes defending national champions was a 50-14 slaying of Michigan in 1968. We went for a two-point conversion on the last touchdown. Somebody said to Woody, why did you go for a two-point conversion? I.e. you would have won 49 or 14. His answer, because I couldn't go for three. There's two things that make this game so important. One is it's Ohio State-Michigan, and two, it's the last regular season game. But to be able to play in a game like this certainly um, is very, very special. The winner of this game wins the Big Ten and will play for the national championship. It's one versus two, the first time it's ever happened in the Ohio State-Michigan game. This is your last year. You know, you don't get another chance to do this again. This game will be the biggest game that any of us ever played. Lynn Edward Schimbeckler and Wayne Woodrow Hayes. There's nothing more in the world that Woody Hayes wanted to do than beat Michigan and Bo Schimbeckler. What it comes down to is it's a one-game season right now. Ohio State and Michigan. Let me tell you what he thought about Michigan. He wouldn't even mention the name. It's Ohio State and Michigan. The University of Michigan campus police will make the road trip. Number one, this is number two. This is only the second time in major college history there's been a conference game between teams 10 and over better. The Michigan guys are talking an awfully good game, probably too good for their guys to back up. In Michigan and Ohio State, Lloyd Carr, Jim Trestle. If Michigan goes in and plays a close game and loses to Ohio State, they deserve to play each other again. <laughs> They believe that we're that beat down old Michigan senior from last year. They have been under the radar. Nobody's given Michigan any respect. Boy, Carr cannot coach against Ohio State. So go deep to your big guys, Manningham, Harrington, and let them make the big play. You can't run the football team. Boy, Carr has struggled to beat Ohio State the last five years. Run my heart, run my heart, run my heart. They can run the ball, they throw the ball, they're talented. It all comes out on Saturday. It doesn't matter about the hype this week. It's shot at the national title on the line, and you're going up against a guy in a sweater vest who has your number. 4-1 so far against the Wolverines. They're number one in point to land. Antonio Floyd Smith keeps the play alive. If we get open that receiver, he will find Anthony Gonzalez. Ted Ginn Jr. Michigan can't cover these guys all day long. Michigan versus Ohio State. One versus two the next game of the century. Buckeyes 24-21. Ohio State 21, Michigan 17. Only two states believe Michigan's going to win. Ohio State, Michigan. Ohio State University. The University of Michigan. I'm picking the Buckeyes. Michigan number one Ohio State. Judgment Day is on the way. They always beat this time of year, but never before like this. In Saturday, Michigan and Ohio State.